Right, hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to convert a video from 30 frames per second to 60 frames per second. As you can see that um, you know, I, there is one software that I always use when I convert the, all the videos from 30 frames per second to 60 frames per second is hybrid and I was searching on YouTube and right now hybrid and uh, this software called hybrid has changed a lot it's like it changes every th every sentence before so today i'm going to show you how i convert from 30 fps to 63 fps and right now you can see that this is the latest version of hybrid so you can see us uh, uh, at the main menu nothing's changed it's just some UI some interface change so right now I'm going I'm going this is the tutorial how to do it in the latest version of hybrid because the older versions are totally different from now so right now I will make an example alright so I'm going to pick a, a short video and right and in here this is the the this video is only for 30 seconds and the and first you change the audio to pass through so that the audio quality will be the same and second you go to the tab x264 and you can see the word special fit bit five size and bit rate to pass so in here uh if i want the if i want the video quality to be better i can change into 15000 okay and in here the av and in over here the avc profile level i will change into 4.2 so because this video is is 1080p so and then uh, and uh, go to the filtering tab you can see there is a called uh, the interlacer so this video is is not shaking so I don't care about that I don't care about change <coughs> change the, the interlacer here but in here there is there is a s called support remember to change into AVI synth so that it will be easier and if your video is not shaking you can disable this tab and now because we use an AV synth we you have to go to the AVI synth tab here and now we go to frame and then there is, and then choose FPS adjust and in here there are four types of frame four times the frame settings but we but if you want to have the best settings choose into frame and then in tuning choose smooth as you can see the and then as you can see the target frame rate right now this is the default it will be now 29.97 I would you have to change into 60 in over here, I'm just going to overwrite our uh, algorithm, and you see that at the, the older versions, they have the override uh, algorithm is smooth or film or something, but right now it changed into numbers. So, to get the best results, I recommend you to choose 21. And if your PC has mm, the dedicated GPU, you can check it here for faster decoding. All right. Now for the output, I will say the thirty seconds FPS save. And now, all right. Let and now the software is decoding. 
Uh, this video is just only 30 seconds, so this will be fast. Uh, being fast. Okay. Because I choose 15,000 kilobit per second, so it will be a little bit long. But don't worry, the longer it takes, the vid the quality of the vi video will be better. Alright, now the video is finished, so I'm going to check it out the uh, results. Alright, so as you can see, this is the, the original video. So, this is the 30 frames per second video. And now I'm going to show you uh, our converted video. Alright, as you can see, that the movement is smoother. It's so smooth. <laughs> it's like it's like uh, in real life. Yeah. Well, as you can see, uh, the movement is smoother. So, <laughs> thank you everyone for watching and as always, stay safe and remember to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. So, thank you very much.